It's time! Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Well, well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. We go inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds, fighting out of Newcastle, England, the gentleman. All right, going through the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come out your corners, come out fighting. And with that touch of the gloves, we are underway. Started here, round one is underway, and we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage, but we know what a high-level striker is, and this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Real quick leg kick. Oh, spinning bad fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. 
big kick. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. All right, so one minute into the fight, and I'm not sure these fighters realize that we got three or five rounds tonight. No feeling out process at all. The moment this fight started, these two gentlemen were ready to knock each other's heads off. Ooh, head kick lands to hurt. Strong defense there to block the shot. Body kick now by Lee. Misses with the jab. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Right punches there. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that landing. Not only will this affect his ability to stand, but he can't really set down on his punches and he won't generate the power that he normally generates because he can't really get heavy on his leg. Both fighters throwing heat now. Ooh, what a punch. Head kick. Lance with the right hand. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. And misses with the right hand. Single collar tie now. That's a big strike right there. You saw us reference in the tail to take DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that jab. Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Body shot after body shot. He keeps landing these strikes. Really zapping the gas tank. They are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh, another strike lands to the liver here. He buckled him with that exact shot earlier in the fight, and he feels like he can still target that area to great effect. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. There. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. Lee's kick is good. Flips the shot. Just out of range with that right hand. Seconds winding down in the opening round. Beautiful strike. Round two straight ahead. Let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's gonna stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this he round. He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit 
with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in... That is how you scramble, folks. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Oh, spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. Nice kick. Well, the body work started to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes up. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Problem getting inside to land that straight punch. He's got a huge edge in reach, and he made good use of it there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, nice takedown defense. That double leg attempt looked like it might be good. He wasn't having it. Circling to his right. I mean, this is his game here. Control your opponent's posture, land those nice elbows around the, around his guard. Big powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Oh, nice, nice. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Lee's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Oh, collar tie. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Oh, big punch land. Spinning back fist. Beautiful body kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh, beating his leg up. Well, from a striking standpoint, he has put it all together tonight. He has landed a ton of significant strikes and pretty easy fight, I would think, for the judges. It's a pretty easy fight to score. Tonight was a night where everything went right, and that doesn't happen very often. Oh, man, hit to play. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. And he landed the right hand there. He blocks the shot. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Right hand upstairs. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Big punch land. Ooh. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, that's a good right hand. 20 seconds left to go in round two. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. And that's the end of round number two. All right, so that's the end of the round. He got some things done offensively, but defense still an issue. And as such, the cut on his lip is only getting worse.
Touchdown. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Whiffs on that offering. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Beautiful one. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Liver kick. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it stop throwing. Spinning back fist is there. Stuff the takedown, no problem. Good punch. You know, one of the offensive fighters is going to start to get frustrated here. Most skips on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Ooh-wee! Ooh-wee, what a right hand by this young man. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Nice one-two there. What a body kick. Oh, a single collar tie there. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. That is what's going to happen. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Yeah? Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Landed that one. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. And back to his feet. Oh, man. You jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. You know, the kicks do hurt, right? These big body kicks, these high kicks, even though they're getting blocked, they do hurt. Blocks that strike. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, great head movement there. Slips his head off the center line, and defensively, that's exactly what you're looking for. It's almost like he can telegraph when the punch is coming. And when he sees it, he just makes a slight little movement, right or left, to get out of the way and avoid those shots. to the body now, that one won't land. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it, lighten up his opponent left and right. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. And they separate. Well, a case of pick your poison here. If you drop the elbow defensively to lessen the body damage, you open yourself up upstairs. He is in some serious trouble now. Great punch landed with so much power. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Nice body. Lands the right punch and follows it up with a nice left hand. Nice sequence there by Lee. Just missed with the left there. Oh, 
Pretty good knee to the body by Lee. Big power shot there. Huge block there. Waning seconds here of round number three. And they separate. Nice elbow. I can't tell if that opened up the cut or not. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future round. champion in the making. Hurt him at the end of that round. He is still going to be hurt. There's no way. All right, here we go with our next round, and really shades yeah. of the Diaz brothers yeah. in that previous round. A Let's lot of volume, down. a lot of accuracy, just a lot of efficiency on him. Very, very efficient. Good round in the sense that he did not throw everything with absolute power, but he was touching the entire time. Then every now and again, he would set down on a strike that was really damaging his opponent. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume. Oh! He's out! Yo, yo! That was nasty! Oh, my goodness, what a fight. A near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So, just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week, played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliana has called a stop to this contest at 39 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the birth of your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight. I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got 